Now in this video we are going to learn about the most interesting command that is the uname command okay so basically this command you use to get the information about uh, your machine okay so basically we will use this uh, command to get the information about this ubuntu machine so uh, we will basically start with this and we will use some of the flags or you can say options with this uh, uh, uname command to get the host name to get the kernel what are the kernel is being used in this particular machine what is the name of the kernel and also you will get uh, multiple information like uh, operating system system hardware platform information machine information everything you will get to know in this particular video so uh, let's start with the implementation part so here you name if you provide without any option if you will uh, execute this command you will just get the uh, like name of the kernel name you will get okay so here you can see uh, as we already know like in the installation video we have saw like uh, the ubuntu is based on the linux kernel so that's why it is showing the Linux. So, but before starting uh, uh, the like going deep into the video, I want to just uh, give you the overview of what is a Linux kernel. Okay, so a Linux kernel is basically you can say is the core of the operating system. Okay, if there is an operating system, the kernel will be the core of that operating system. Why? Because it creates an interface, you can say, or creates a connection between your hardware, hardware, and your software. Okay, so basically uh, kernel uh, has uh, all the control of your operating system. If kernel fails, then whole operating system will get failed. You can say like that also. So I hope that is uh, basic uh, information is clear to you. And uh, uh, we will see about kernel release. What is kernel release? So uh, let me tell you about the kernel release. So kernel release is nothing but whenever a new version is released of a kernel. Like uh, if there is suppose version is suppose 5.0.1 you can say like that then uh, again new version is create, uh, release that is 5.0.2 so why this new version and why this new kernel release has been done because if there is uh, some vulnerability or any bugs in the first kernel then that bug will get patched and then again new release will be done okay new kernel release will be done okay so that is the concept of basically kernel release so now we will see the uh, kernel release so for this we basically use the hyphen r option so here you can see the now currently version and kernel release version of this machine is this 5.15.041 generic okay so in this way you can get the kernel release information now moving forward uh let me just show you this uh, linux uh, like kernel name you can use the hyphen s option also to get the uh, kernel name okay so uh, like both will give you the same result like uname and uname hyphen s uh, okay and uh, now next moving forward uh, if you want to get the uh, host name of your computer like host name is uh, like that name uh, which is used over the network you can say like that so if you you will do uname hyphen n then obviously you will get the host name as in my case this is ayush virtual box is the host name and again uh, next if you want to get information about your machine about your processor then you can use hyphen m for your machine you name hyphen m for your machine so like it is 64 bit you can say uh, you can see here it is and uh, next if you want to get information about your processor then it's also easy you can get using hyphen p option so same information is being displayed here like it is the basically the architecture okay so now next moving forward uh, if you want to get a hardware platform all those things you will get the same i think yeah hardware platform is the same 64 bit and to get the name of the operating system so obviously it is uh, gnu linux so linux operating system it is ubuntu so now again uh, like uh, there is also one uh, super command you can say like super option that is hyphen a option which basically gives you all the result of uh, these like you do you don't need to write this all to get if uh, kernel release you 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 don't need to uh, write hyphen r hyphen s hyphen n anything you can use a simple command that is a uname hyphen a hit enter and here you will get the all the above information like linux is the kernel name this is the host name this is the version and this is the uh, what you can say i think this is uh, your uh, version name it may be yeah it should be version name like hashtag ubuntu smp 
yeah it's a kernel version name it is and next is the date of creation or installation and next is your all the architecture processor architecture everything you can see and the, and at the last you can see the name of the operating system so i hope you liked it guys uh, that was a very uh, basic tutorial so that's all for today's video and if you have any queries then you can ask in the comment section so thank you for watching and we'll meet in the next video thank you thank you so much